What's going on everybody? Is Milro back? Uh, didn't decide not to attend this episode, uh, but welcome back to the Race Level 300. Day 30, we're over a third of the way. Level 107. Got another ninja that I want to be taking on here pretty soon, but we're going to wait on a new little creation. But uh, farm is looking good, got the dew collectors going pretty good. And been a, been a pretty peaceful overnight. That a zombie I see on the wall? No, not really. Yeah, it's been pretty. It's been pretty quiet around here. But um, just kind of been waiting on the shotgun I've been making. I got some mods in the old inventory for the shotty, so I figured you know, like, uh, I love the M60 and the SMG, but I'm like, be nice to have a third kind of primary weapon to work on and we'll have with. I know some of you might be asking, why not just, why not make a, a an auto shoddy? And to be honest, I really don't, well it's like I, I don't have a tier, I don't have like tier 6 crafting yet, so I'm like, and auto shoddies are really expensive, like the, the pump action shotgun already took 90 steel and it's like, I max out. I maxed out uh, auto shotty for what you get is like it takes you like um, 150 steel if I'm remembering correctly. Die the shotgun and besides, it's like to me at least it's like I know people will probably go like, oh the the auto shotty is statistically better and all this blah 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 blah. It's like. Like, a, why would you take a, take the pump action over and everything? It's like, I personally like the feel of the pump action more. It's like, it's more satisfying to be able to kind of, you know, take a shotgun and, to a zombie's face and and then uh, blow it away and, you know, and have that kind of satisfying racking of the pump. It's just personal preference. It's like, kind of, sometimes you gotta have, like, something that, feels better to you like you know than like just pure stats kind of like not and not always about like the, the spreadsheets but here we are our little raid here we're gonna be taking on the ostrich hotel an old friend from legacy version that I haven't raided before on on the new version so let me just park up here you gotta have at least some sort of Parking kind of sense in the zombie apocalypse. Look at that though. The Ostrich Hotel. Doesn't look like it's changed all that much since Legacy. Like, maybe like a little bit on. The only thing I kind of don't really see is like the old garage that used to exist. Let me just take a look around that. Okay, so they kind of relocated the old garage. I apologize for any frame rate issues around here. I just kind of want to get an idea, of, like a feel for the for the POI, just kind of on the outside a little bit. Looks good. So let's run around and we'll kind of get started on this. I figured kind of get started bright and early. See how the shotgun likes to uh, taking out zombies. I do have four out of five in boomsticks, so. All right, climb up the ladder. What was that? Okay then. So, I presume this is gonna be like kind of. I don't know what to expect from Ostrich Hotel. So. Oh, hello, good sir. See you later. Oh, birds up top. Try and take care of them. We already got our classic, the radiated. Oh, come here. Ow. Pump shotgun, do your work, please. Take care of Birdie. Figure just kind of uh, more of some. Take care of some. Just more fun. 
bit more curve and variety in combat. Not doing too bad. Especially considering it's going up against radiates. Question is where am I supposed to go now? Wouldn't be a bad idea to check through here. You know, pile that yeah, crossbow bolts don't really want those. Um check out Looks like they're kinda of dropping a new sign. Hmm, maybe new ownership. Alrighty. Now this is kind of the ostrich I kind of know a bit more like the layout. Hello? Come on in. Oh hi. See you later. And... Ooh. Somebody had a fun night. Basically a pretty clear operation around here. If it's if it's clear most of the zombies out of the, out of the rooms like I don't mind. See you later. Make sure you're all taken care of. Seems like a lot of like a uh, cloth that you could claim around here. What about this room? Hmm? Oh, looks like it's in, in, in progress. Sorry, didn't mean to interrupt you on your lunch break. Nice to see that everybody's happy around here. Um, not too... Looks like construction type boxes and everything. I wonder if it's kind of like because of how old this POI is and how I know it used to be. It's going to be kind of just like how you used to do it. Like, uh, just clear every floor and call it good. See you later. Come here. Hello. Apparently Ostrich Hotel was, uh, allows dogs. Come here. There you go. Cave your face in a little bit. Our ammunitions box. A little bit of ammunition. And I like how these rooms are kind of looking like they have their own um uh theme. I like it. Sorry, just my stuttering. Hello. Take care of you. Take Mr. Hoodie. And sorry about your luck there, bud. Grab that. Tier 4 auger. Uh, make sure I can just kind of clear through this room a little bit. Make sure that's clear. Anybody in here? Oh! I see. You guys were having your fun in here. Yeah, come on, shotgun. Oh, I can't stand that ghosting of pellets, otherwise, unless I'm straight up missing, can't really tell. There, take care of you. You were told to evacuate. Might as well just take care of this and also search these chemistry sets. Balls of acid and glue I find mostly out of them. So at least there's some of that in here. Nitrate powder. What do you got in the meds? Ooh, honey. Don't mind if I do. Check out these books really quick. And nothing out of shotgun weekly. Just forgot about medical journal. Seven more books away from being able to complete medical journal. And one last sweep of this room. Okay. Down to the next floor, how we go. 
Wherever there, you know, wherever that staircase may be. There we are. Hello! Oh, it's Tony! Back up a little bit. Okay. Tony's twin brother's in there. Yes, come up the stairs. I know you want M60. Must have cleared out this room and this room and... This one seems like a more regular room. Oh boy. Make sure everybody else is cleared. And... Oh hi! Mikey! I didn't... Mike, I didn't know you were bringing in friends. Come here. Mikey brought all of his friends to the hotel. Why am I not surprised by this? See you later. Wait, that's a dip. Cops down. Come here. Alrighty then. Did not realize they were gonna spawn in my face for that one. Check around. That staircase. Hello? Anybody in here? Anybody? Unfortunately, I don't have the bonus that allows me to blow through doors like there's no tomorrow. Oh, okay. Um, breach and clear. Make sure there's no zombies around. Oh, more Tonys. Come here. Come here. There you go. Salsify your head a little bit. Nope. Looks like we're. Looks like that's clear. Yeah, it seems like just kind of a big old, like, you know, clear, kind of clear every floor. You'll be fine for now. Oh. Bleeding again. Man. Take care of copper and take the med kit. I think we're clear for this time being. Ergonomic group mod schematic. I'll take care of that. Thank you. Make sure we can go into the maintenance closet. Make sure everybody's all fine and dandy here. And. Nope, nobody in here. It seems like they're just all hiding in the living room. Anybody else? Oh. Hang on. Try and take care of this guy. There's at some point where I can just kind of start. See you later. And what I was gonna say is like, to sneak sneak up on a zombie and just pull the trigger and blow him away with one shot. See you later. Is everybody cleared in this room? Hmm? Okay. Looking good. Looking good. And... Check around here. Anybody in this room? No? Alright. Main lobby. Another Tony. Tony must really love the Osprey Trace. Level 109, we're up to two skill points to spend. Did I take care of him? I think so. Come here. I will take your arms off and make sure you wear them. Your mouth. 
I'll check the books here. Knife guy. More electrical stuff. Got big hitters for Zen later, so. Armor. Um, doors locked. Ooh, I guess I forgot about the zombie loot. Batter up. That is. He heard you were giving calzones two for one. <laughs> Tony heard I was giving out calzones for you know, two for one. Oh boy, that makes a lot of sense. Come here. Yeah, Tony for Tony. He wants calzone. That that's the lobby there. Vending machine. Unfortunately, I don't have the money. Otherwise, I would purchase the old uh, learn elixir there. Hello, key rack over here. Seems like that's all right. And anything in here? Shotgun weekly. We'll read that in a little bit. Elevator door is unlocked. Check the kitchen here. Oh look! It's the Feral White. He's radiated. Come here. Don't be sticking your head in the laundry. Ah, great. Like, like sprained. Eh. Whatever. Yeah, he's hiding in here. Okay. That just looks like a loot stash. That's the. I was thinking. I was thinking. Please tell me I'm not going to be going in there and have to clear out the joint. Ah, the parking garage. That's a lot of zombies. Oh my. Oh, might as well kick out and kick off the party. Come here. Take care of all of you. Oh great, my legs are broken. Come here. I'm sure they're probably Oh boy. Back up a little bit. Oh, I, at least this uh, hotel is uh, friendly to cops. Eh. Run back a little bit. No, go away. Some dudes here. Alright. I think we might be okay with shotgun. Mr. Radiated. Go away. All things, please. Just go. There we go. I missed a room. Ah, crap. Oh, I'll go clear it. Oh, how I love broken legs. Maybe we gotta go up one more flight of stairs and then we can... Hopefully call us good. Hmm. Oh, look at would you look who's here. Two more Tonys. And come here. There. Job is done. What the question is what do we have for our main loot? Ah, we'll just jump down. Well you yeah, have drop loot for me. Presser mod schematics and books. So oh, I gotta read some of these. And probably not too much other. Oh hey, finally, cement mixer unlocked. It's a good thing I I don't only have like a hundred thousand stone for for all that. Part of that's caved in. 
Ah. Here is the main loot. Alright, give me a second. I'll get this picked into for you guys. I think you... I'd have to look at it. Oh! Alrighty, guys. So, I was breaking into the loot, and, well... Would you look at this? I did not... Uh, that's a fun little surprise. A, a demo. Oh, how nice of you to drop me some actual boss loot. Urban Combat Volume 5. I don't know if Zen has that. But, dang it, I was hoping that was going to be Urban Combat Volume 7, so I could finally run suppressors. Give me that. Five more books away. I I yeah, I haven't really read it like I say, first time reading it, but I'm like, hmm, interesting. <laughs> Thank goodness it's not as bad as some of the other POIs in the game where the um the game likes to be a troll, like Minotaur Theater. Just throw that in. And because I got a broken leg, I'm actually going to take this and write it down into the ramp. Really, the big thing, like, when breaking it into that is the is the big old uh, the big old box. So let's check it out. After we break into these, it's like. So, Ricochet, Shock of Messiah, Passing Gas, another wheel with some salvage tools, we got machine gun parts out of there, working stiffs with some cobblestone repair kits, tier 5 machete, not too bad, another Forge Ahead book, and got to search my old run the medical supplies, another medical journal, weapons bag. It looks like another shotgun book. And... Not too bad of main loot. Let's just take a look at... Nailgun quality 3 out of that, and... Medical journal... Shotgun weekly, nothing good. Ratchet quality 3, we're getting close to a level up though. I cannot accept that- oh, I haven't gotten taken... Taylor's treasure map. Yeah, I'm impressed with how they updated Ostrich Hotel. It looks good, so I'm going to uh, go over to Trader Joel's and catch you over there. And Crest in the Hill, uh, to Joel's, and here we are. Let's take. Let's hope that Joel has something good. Looks like the one door's been left open. Okay, the gate's been left open. Nice see what his reward is for me. Hope it's something good, especially since I got that sprain leg. Joel, you better have something good. I'm hobbling in here. You congratulations! I'll 50 break steel. out the grandpa's moonshine so I can celebrate. Mmm. I'm going to take the take the steel off you good sir and I did max out daring adventure so I'm actually gonna take those steroids with and one more fetch or one more job if you want to earn some dukes we've Vandy got no tower action. remember to buy some armor if you take this even hotel I where I am saying no wow <laughs> think of all the Grover stuff you high from me if you can how are you gonna get ahead or... work if you need dukes Pop and bills. I guess we'll accept that. Give you 5% off anything but uh, free funds. Oh, you won't be needing one. Trust me. Want to buy a, a splint off old Jolly Boy here just for you are just to have a just so I can try to heal my leg a bit. And we'll take a. I actually have two steroids, so. Buy that off. We'll just inject those into me. Can take because of my uh, iron gut. I can take a whole bunch of that stuff, and I'm going to buy these yucca juice smoothies because they are some of the best drinks in the game for water. 
Uh, we'll take a we'll take a med kit as well, just to get myself going. Bird. No. Go. Bye bye. Okay. Uh, I was kind of thinking, do I really want to go over to Pop and Pills Factory and raid that at the moment, or do I want to go go kind of respy on stuff? I'm going to go back to the base real quick, and I'm going to run back, uh, and we'll kind of ride back over. So I'll catch you at Pop and Pills Factory, folks. Alright guys, here we are at Pop and Pills Factory. This one is gonna be interesting. That's a I've done this guys like tier six before, but it's like so I kinda know what to expect out of this for so it won't be that bad. Big big size factory, it's like but it's like That should be that should be good. Like I know there's cops that will spawn in, so gotta be careful of them. Okay. Hello. A little bit dreamy, which I apologize for, but come here, guys. Give, give you all the shotgun. There we go. Let's right you your faces and see you later, big copper and. See you later, take your arm off. He wasn't needing it anyways. Bit of extra 762, got some weapon racks here. Check the equipment for see if there's anything worth it. Maybe that tier five um mining gloves. Just scrap that down for, for armor parts. One thing to be aware of with this is like there is a hidden spire zombie here. Shush. Hush little zombie. There's a little medical supplies. And have to clear out like basically all the offices here. Take care of you. Come here. Come on out. The water's fine. This door is locked and that's a locked door. So we'll run, get bum rushed by businessmen here. You know, what am I doing? I I forgot about my tier 5, to my tier 6 knuckles. I haven't even used them basically the whole episode. I'm like, silly me. Gotta give them some love too. Where are the... Then we move through here, there will be another little bum rush here. One thing I really like about this POI is like I really like these chemistry sets, like because um, kind of mentioned before, like these chemistry sets they like, tend to give a good amount of glue, and so it's like I like the raidness once in a while for some pretty glue. Oh hello, hello hello. You ordered a knuckle sandwich, huh? There you go. And then we open up this door. Yep. Lots more zombies. Come on in. There we go. Lots of zombies are down. The supplies are nearby, but... Not in our general vicinity yet. Two more acids out of those chemistry sets. Man, we've got four acid. Like, that is a really good find there. Pile books, more medical journals. Let's see, what do we got for... Sure, probably maxed out. Yep. Unlock steroid crafting. Don't craft at home, kids. And got zombies dropping through the roof here. Come on. 
Mr. Businessman feels like being a Jolly Rancher today. Come on. See you later. And you. You were stuck behind the couch. Huh. Um, we'll take a. Let's take a spare med kit. And. Now we go up to the top here. What I'm gonna do is a. Just a little precaution. Let's just take a take a beer while I still have it. And there's lots of gotta be lots of zombies. Come here, Tony, Mikey. We got the oh, we got the troublesome duo. Come here. Don't be shy. I got knuckle sandwiches for everyone. Got a level up from this game and come here. There we go. Might as well check our skill points super quick. Um, gonna invest into better barter maxed out just so can get better deals at the trader. Be careful of those because you will, they will collapse on you. Now we kind of start the descent in here. There will be zombies in here. This guy always, this type of zombie always kind of spawns in here. It's like wiped out infestation. It's like, I think he's supposed to be kind of like the botanist, I guess. Um, that's a barrel. Can be kind of good. Let's try and beat this open really quick. Unfortunately, no acid out of there. Hello. Yeah, I, I was told that you wanted some knuckle sandwiches for the lunch. I'm here to provide. Thank you. Got popping pills. We got a little key rack. Which I think that sets off a bunch of zombies. And we're just gonna run up here. Oh great, I forgot to load the M60. Ah! Oh great. Lovely. Thank you. Yep. Single file line. You get your knuckle sandwiches. Two for one deal. Even three for one if you really felt like it. I was kind of beat through this popping pills though. It's... And not too bad. I could make a... Could make a first aid bandage out of that really quick. There we go. And we should be getting close in our supplies, but one thing you gotta be careful of is this little staircase here. Because there is a hole and spider zombie. Might as well give him a little blast from the past. And there's our courier satchel. We just gotta clear out all of these zombies. Um, what was I gonna do really quick? I was trying to think of something. Right, reload the the SMG and the uh, the M60. Don't want to be caught with my pants down again. Doors unlocked. Got a oh, got Mr. Radiator over here. Come here. I will, uh, I will beat you to submission. You will kind of die from me. Thank you. And then, then you run through here, and there is some zombies. Could be wise to clear out. Um, trying to remember if I thought of the right spot or not. Nah. And of course, We've got the lab technicians here. And this is where you kind of look at it, because it, so this can be a missable area if you're not paying attention. That guy's taken care of. Check around here just to be absolutely certain. Lock pick, not too bad. So. Come here. Oh, 
all the construction workers. Thank you. Slice his face open. You want to be careful of this little room, but there is a little bit of loot. Got an ammo pile over here. Arrows and bullet casings we want. There is... There is at least a radiated and... Well, not radiated, a girl white and a... And the, um, whatchamacallit. You do get a couple of loot boxes here for that. Working says, like, some general good stuff. And might as well take a second to read those real quick. Vehicle Adventures, and then Forge Candyland. Go back a little bit. This and this POI, kind of easy to get a little caught up, like uh, when you're trying to clear it, because like it can be a little confusing if you you're not aware of this. So there's typically not zombies like uh, on those catwalks I was just walking on. So, but there are some in here. Three. Come on in. I'll give you a hug. There we go. Take care of him really quick. Do you want to just check up here in the... I think this is more like a hidden loot room than anything. Yep. Check C. Anything good? Vitamins. Gladly take them. And... It's getting close to nighttime, so we won't have the time to turn the quest in for the night, but that's okay. It's no biggie. Vending machine. Don't really have the money, otherwise I would buy the stuff. Unlocked door. We got a server room here. And then we got a room there. But... Just check to see if there's any. What game is this, please? Uh, Seven Days to Die console version. Try winning. Got a big loot room here. Yeah, guys, uh, on YouTube, like as you're watching this recording, no problem. Um, you know, watch on YouTube. Yo, you're interested. Uh, you know, watching the streams, like, I do stream this series, and I usually stream, we get them, but stream three times a week, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 4 p.m. Central Time, Standard Time currently. Come here. Do, 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 do. Come here. A little bit of bleeding. Oh, well. There you go, take care of you. You're still not down? Alright. Um, this is one of the missile rooms, like, take care of you. I'm gonna pull out the M60 for this. And... And... Still not clear of the POI yet, because there is just lots and lots of them around here. There is Tony for Tony. We're up to level 112. There's also at least like one or two uh, the big mutated guys. More medical stuff if you really feel like looting it. One thing I love doing, like you know, after kind of clearing the staircase, is oh hi. You know, after kind of taking the advantage to clean these guys out is come through this door and then hit this button. That's your... It opens up a steel hatch to uh, allow you to clean out the... Uh, well, get through the... Um, what am I trying to say? The... Um, just allows you to get out easier. That's kind of your exit. 
you have to kind of clear these catwalks and everything, and then, then like I kind of finished off with these certain offices. Hello, radiant. Come here. Take care of you. Come here. And there's one last uh, little area to clean out here. Go ahead and punch me. Take your arm off. There you go. See you later. Got a couple more batter up books for Zen. And chemistry set. See the job's done though. One testosterone extract. Your main loot is is down there and also up here. Oh we're gonna break into this quick it's this POI is not exactly one of the, not not really that hard in my opinion kind of one of the easier tier fives to clean out just one of those it's like I will say this with every tier five in the game just well, with any POI just make sure you're ready to clean out any, clean out um well you have ammunition and have like a at least like I'd say a stack of medical kits you know first aid kits it really helps it's like speak yeah, I'm speaking from experience so uh, let's see hopefully we're almost broken through here there we are hard chest and it's like I found these hard chests if you can loot them fairly easily they give you a good um, little stack of stuff just gonna read through a couple books here. And there you go. Oh no 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 no, those are my scavenging gloves. That's that's my bad. Um Also can read through a lot of this. So Forge Head, Shotgun Weekly. Yeah, a lot of these give you like those tier five inch chests, they can give give out like good food bundles. They can like I'm talking like they'll give you like food bundles that have big ass uh, like they'll give you like a stack of high quality food. It could be like shepherd's pie, spaghetti, um, gumbo stew, like really good, really good food like that you can use to keep yourself. Uh, um, nourished throughout the zombie apocalypse and in this game and so let's just I'm just kind of making my run up to grab the rest of the loot and you know throw it throw it all in and let's see what we got from the rest of this it's like I would say like if you're gonna raid multiple um, tier fives I would say to let me check this really quick. You really want to have something like a a couple of um, you want to have like a four by four or a gyrocopter because like I found you can only do like if you're really like if you're not being too stingy on loot like really only like two POIs like. At tier five, let alone tier six, because like the tier six gives you so much ammunition. I think that's most of the main loot. Yep, got it. So, and I apparently forgot a loot bag over there. Let's see. Grab that tier five. Oh man, not too bad. So, grab that and. We'll break it to this box quick. Oh boy, bone knife quality six. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna call it good here uh, for an episode. If you made it this far and you like what you see, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below. It helps the channel oh so much. It helps the channel out so much. And turn on notifications, please. Have a good one and take care.